Respiratory viruses are a triple threat this holiday season. RSV, influenza, and COVID-19. It's a maelstrom hard to navigate as the symptoms are so similar. Public Health's Bureau of Communicable Disease Control Administrator Annette again says our efforts to protect the community from COVID-19 changed the patterns of RSV and the flu. I think people are hearing from the states, oh, there's this triple uh, pandemic, right, or triple, uh, the concern of this triple threat, and it's true. COVID-19 has really uh, changed a lot of the regular patterns we would see with RSV and flu. And again, RSV and flu has been around. It's nothing new. It's why this National Influenza Vaccination Week, health officials say it is all the more important to be educated and vaccinated against the flu. I can never say it enough. Get immunized Guam. Uh, for, for young children who've never had the vaccine, you know, the infants and stuff, they, the minimum age is six months of age. It is a proven vaccine. As for navigating what illness is which, she recommends monitoring your child as illness progresses and don't wait until it's too late to seek medical attention. And she leaves us with this message. And I know for our culture, we love to kiss the babies and hug the babies, but please, uh, Please protect the young ones. We don't know what we're having, what we're spreading to them. They can't tell us what's wrong with them. They they can only cry. Uh, so again, by all means, prevention first, you know, and uh, to get immunized, please. Matsuki Hirayama, KUAM News.